come with me to a nine hour flight to Japan. This is my first time traveling with TSW, so I'll be talking about my experience at the end of the video, so stay tuned. everyone um, today I thought I'd talk a little bit about my experience flying with TSW it was a nine hour flight to come to Japan and my flight was a morning flight so I got on at 9 15 a.m. and got to Japan at 5 p.m. but there's a two hour difference so 7 p.m. Australia time um, and I'm so glad that it was a morning flight because usually at night my cortisol level goes rises and I get really itchy. So I didn't have to deal with the itch. And a lot of people asked me how my skin held up with the air in the airplane. But I didn't notice any unusual reactions or anything like that. Um, I didn't get itchy as much as I would have usually um, gotten so I don't know maybe because it was I'm honestly not sure why I didn't get itchy during the flight but I was sleeping for the first five hours and then um, I woke up and I only had four more hours left and I watched some movies ate oh I had a gluten-free meal during the flight um, so that was good. I had a red sticker on my seat and yeah. So it was a good flight. Um, I, oh yeah, the security um, process was pretty stressful because I had to take my mask, my glasses and my hat off and reveal my whole skin. Um, luckily it was towards a machine, but there was heaps of people around and like the airport staff was around too so it was pretty stressful to have to deal with that and uncover my face and it was so much more flakier than i am today so yeah that was one thing i don't wish to do again and hopefully by the time i go back in two and a half months or more my skin will be a lot better yeah so that was my update and that was my experience flying over here with TSW. Let me know if you guys have any questions around that. And I'm happy to answer them.